Well, speaking of dogs, let's move into another ACC tilt here. And the Louisville Cardinals are headed to Florida State. Florida State, a one and a half point underdog at home, 61 and a half. Again, the lines brought to you by BetUS, where the game begins. You can, of course, click the link in the description. Go ahead and get signed up over there. Use the promo code NCAAF2021 for 125% deposit bonus up to $2,500. Louisville, four and one against the spread in their last five against Florida State. And they seem to really find something against UCF. They've got the rest advantage here. They have an extra day of rest after beating UCF at home on Friday night last week. Florida State went on the road to Wake Forest, got absolutely pummeled without the guys in their offensive line that they had to start the season against Notre Dame. They have been dreadful, absolutely awful. McKenzie Milton, as as much as we have loved the story and everything, I mean, his average yards per pass is like five. I mean, it, it, there's there's no explosive passing game. The running game without that offensive line has basically been shut down. Jordan Travis is somewhat injured. The defense is bleh. And, and while I would like to say, yeah, this is they're going to come out pissed off. They they shouldn't have been beaten by that many. Da, da, da. Like, Wake Forest took them behind the woodshed, man. I, I'm going against Florida State again here. Give me Louisville. Like, I, even on the road, I think Louisville found something last week. I, I think that they are going to come out fired up for this game. I think Florida State has made – Florida State may win two games this year, man. All right. So, some of this is a won't, and some of this is a feel, okay? Okay. I want Mike Norvell to be better than this. I, I need Florida State to find something here, okay? But but here's the other part of this. I think last week – I've heard you saying that. I've heard a lot of other people in college football saying, move a found something, move a found something. And I don't really found anything. I have seen too many weeknight football games where the home team just plays far above their caliber. All right? It happens every year. It happens all the time. And I don't want to overreact to that. I don't think this global team is great. I think they've got a lot of flaws. I think they played above their head. And I think one team in here is desperate and the other team just celebrated for a week. That's what I – and, and I'm going to go with the desperate team. I feel like such a moron taking Florida State right now. I just I, – I, it, it seems stupid, but I'm going to do it because I think it's the right thing to do. I really do. I'm going to take the team that's desperate for a win when the other team just got a huge win on national TV. I, I'm going to do that. It, it, it makes sense. It absolutely makes sense. I, I feel where you're coming from. Uh, I am going to go the other way, though. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.